it is me and my tea. And after a hiatus, it is finally here. It is the one and only June 2021 Go Your Own Way Owl Crate Box. And without further ado, let's finally get into it, shall we? Trusty pocket knife. So after a delay, my Owl Crate box is here. If you're unfamiliar with Owl Crate, it is a really cool YA subscription service, and every month you get a book signed, a new book signed by the author, and some bookish goodies. And ooh, let's see what we have. So first thing I see on top, as River Song would say, are spoilers. It is our spoiler card for this month. Shan't look at that because I don't like to be spoiled. And I'm pretty sure I can guess most of the themes. Ooh, so first off, we have a lunch tote. Cool. And very handy. Ooh, I love that design. I believe it's from the Throne of Glass series. So we open up. Ooh, doo -doo. Ah, and it is nicely lined. So that means that if you have something hot, it will stay hot. Or if you pack ice cream in it, it will stay cold. I think I'm going to put some ice cream in this if I ever go shopping. Very useful. So up next, we have this really cute decorated box. And it says, Reading Through the Season. Our salute to summertime and its carefree days is this beautiful water bottle. Ooh. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. So... First thing, it has a handle, which I love. It is this gorgeous little metal water bottle, and it says, Summer Was a Book of Hope. And that's special to me because my very first Owl Crate box was Summer Lovin', and I got a wooden bookmark with this quote on it, and so that is super, super special. And I guess this box marks three years that I've gotten Owl Crate boxes, so even cooler. So up next... We have, it looks like, a little velvet pouch, and it's really heavy. Ooh, very nice. So let's see what we have in here. Ooh, cool. So we have this really gorgeous coin, and on one side it says smooth sailings, and on the other side it says rough seas, and it is designed by Iron and Ink. Oh, it is a, from the, um, the Fable series, it is the Wayfinder coin. That is really cool and nicely heavy. Awesome quality owl crate. Up next, ooh, we have a real, another really heavy item in another velvet baggie. So, let's see what this one is. Ooh, this looks, <gasps> it's a bee. I love bees. Oh, cool. It's a bee key. It says, no story ever truly ends as long as it is told. Oh, that's cool. Wait, is there a thingy in here? Yes. And it is... Oh, it's a bottle opener. Oh, cool. So this is from the Starless Seas, and I think this part right here on the bee is the bottle opener. That is so cool and clever. And it has magnets on the back, so it could be... Just awesome magnet. Cool if you're not using it as a bottle opener. That is so neat. Cool. All right, next we have a little promotional item, it looks like. And this is promoting Six Crimson Cranes by Elizabeth Lim. Oh, she did the Spin the Dawn series, which is a really top-notch series. I love that series. So I cannot wait to see that book. Next. <gasps> wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So we have a gilded piece of artwork, and it looks like this is Strange the Dreamer. Yes, I think this is Strange the Dreamer. Wow, this is just plain stunning. Oh, this is going to be hung up right away. I'm a sucker for anything with foiling or guilt, so it's my guilty pleasure. So up next we have our monthly pin. Here we are. So here we have this month's pin. And it says you can be more than what the stars wish for. Ooh. That's really a cool quote. So up next. Oops. One moment, please. I have to open up the book. Okay. 
book open. So first thing I see is our letter, not from our author, but from our authors. And it is by, our book this month is by two sisters, and the book is Sisters of the Snake. Ooh, and it's this really cool teal color. So of course it is signed by our authors this month. Let's see if there's any special goodies. Ooh, ooh, it's a double, it's a double goodie. So not only do we have two beautiful gilt serpents on our book this month, but oh, this month's dust jacket is reversible. So we have a beautiful piece of artwork there. That is so cool. So neat. I love it when there's double surprises. So let's see what this book has to say for itself. Princess Ronnie has heard the whispers. Snake princess, they call her. A girl with fangs for teeth. Her people fear her, and yet her father doesn't believe her capable of ru ruling. Rhea is the quickest thief this side of the Var River. That's why she's still alive. But when she is constricted into a looming war, she knows that she has to be quicker than ever before to elude the royal army's grasp. These two lives collide, turning everything upside down because... Orphan and princess are unmistakably identical. A deal is struck. Both can get what they want if they switch places for less than one moon's time. But danger lurks in both worlds, and the two are thrust into a race to unravel a mysterious prophecy to locate a long-lost mystical object. To save their home, thief and royal must work together or watch it all fall to ruin. Ooh, dun, dun, dun. This sounds like it's going to be a really cool retelling, a female retelling of The Prince and the Pauper, which I love that story. So this sounds like it's going to be an excellent summer read, and I'm super excited. So finally, we have our last two items. We have our lovely newsletter, which I absolutely love because it will have an interview with the author. We have the original um, cover and the Owl Cray cover. I love the changing to teal. I think that really makes the artwork really pop. And we have a fun little crossword game, some book recommendations, interview with the vendors, Instagram photo challenge, interview with the authors over on, um, I think it's Instagram Live, a Spotify playlist, and other books that are coming out this month. And my favorite part, and it is the theme for July, so the box that will be coming later this month, is Potions and Poisons. Ooh, I am super excited because I heard that there is going to be items themed from Alice in Wonderland and the Chronicles of Narnia, and those are some of my favorite fandoms. And every July box will have a kitchen item designed by Amy Mack, and Amy Mack did... The Lord of the Rings botanical illustrations in the Growing Wild box that was a couple months ago. I'll put a little link up there so you can check out that video. And they were just, just so incredibly beautiful. And I am super excited to have more of her stuff. Well, everybody, I hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you're interested in watching another video, go ahead and click right here. And if you are new, welcome to my channel, and go ahead and click that subscribe button right there so you never miss my videos ever again. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!